Sueña, hermano, sueña. Dirígete hacia el futuro abriendo horizontes nuevos. Como el grano de trigo muere para dar fruto, ayúdanos, Señor, a ser pequeña semilla, sencilla, tierna, alegre. Ayúdanos a que consintamos que el amor envuelva nuestra vida. Amén. I actually, I, I had to do this thing where every time I get a pen and I'm kind of just hanging out, I write why on the palm of my hand. And sometimes when I ask myself like, oh, like, what am I doing? I'll look down. El camino eh, te posibilita hacer el propio camino interior que todo el mundo tenemos que hacer. ¿eh? Entonces, eh, yo creo que todos los momentos en el camino son especiales. The support is always there. And it's, it's nice knowing that even though they don't have all the answers, they, they know the right questions to ask. Y quizás esto sea lo que sea la mejor propuesta vocacional. ¿Cuál es la voluntad de Dios en tu vida? Pues yo creo que, que en la vida necesitamos compañeros de camino. Y sentirnos compañeros de camino afianza nuestra, nuestra fraternidad. Yo creo que las personas jóvenes se dan cuenta, si están bien, que los hermanos te llaman para ser quien tú eres. We come with our strengths and our gifts, and that's what we offer to God and to the community. And that's enough. We're all pilgrims. Um, every human is a pilgrim in some way, um, and we are called to walk together. Because we all have our own pace, we all have different pains. And I think even the pains themselves tell so much about The way, the, way we, like, the way we walk. En esos momentos de silencio que, que el camino te, te, te proporciona, yo creo que vas dando sentido a eso que vas viviendo. Yo creo que el, el sustrato del camino es eso, una búsqueda del inconformismo, de reconocernos hermanos en un, en un mundo, en un planeta muy plural. Ser hermano es igual aquí en España que en Estados Unidos, que en Filipinas, que en Japón, o que en Roma. I think part of the reason that some of us choose consecrated life is that we do seek a life of adventure. We want life to be a challenge for us in a good way, in the best sense of the word. And When we choose that life, we don't get to choose the, the schedule in which the difficult parts will come. And I think part of this walking has been like that. I think some of the biggest things you learn in the Camino is that it's not always about your plan. It's about opening yourself up to the possibilities and to God and to just the trail and just pushing forward. Thank you for being with us each day. Encourage us, we pray, in our struggle for justice, love, and peace. We're, we're, we're completely blessed by the kinds of things that happen to us, even the difficult ones. But we only see that later on, because as the saying goes, the road straightens out behind us, not in front of us. And my experience has certainly been that in, in the brothers. The refrain that we used uh, during a prayer, uh, the nothing will separate us from God's love for us. And for some reason on the Camino, there's really not much more room for anything else that we tend to carry around in our hearts. The only thing that I felt that I was carrying or that I continue to carry in my heart during this Camino experience is Jesus. Oh.
Ramana, Sri 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 Ramana